everyone, welcome to another fun and exciting tutorial Tuesday. Except today's not Tuesday, it's Wednesday, because I'm one day late this week. Sorry! I was actually waiting for this really cool new backdrop and lighting kit that I got so I can make better quality videos for you guys. And it was supposed to come yesterday, so I was waiting, waiting, waiting to make the video until it arrived. And then I realized that I had it sent to the wrong address. <laughs> So, this morning I got up first thing and we drove over to the address that the package was shipped to, to commandeer it, and uh, we got it, it was our little recon mission, um, and so now it's set up and I can make my video for you today. So thanks for waiting patiently for one extra day this week, but I do have a really cute balloon tutorial for you today, I think you're really going to like it, so hopefully you'll forgive me. Okay, let's get started. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a hamster out of balloons. Random, I know, but we've covered all the basic animals so far, so now I'm kind of going into weird stuff. <laughs> but uh, this was a request from somebody on YouTube, so keep sending your requests in the comments below. I am seeing all of them and kind of keeping them in a list so that I can do them in future videos. So if there's something you want to know how to make, just let me know and we'll get to it eventually. <laughs> okay, hamster. So I'm going to make a brown hamster. I've never owned a hamster before. I'm sure some of you have. Oh, actually, I had a robo dwarf hamster. He was like this big. It was really cool. It was more like a entertainment for my cats, but you know how that goes. So anyway. Um, let me think. I think we're only going to need, I'm going to do two, two brown balloons for this hamster and one white balloon. And you might also need uh, one of these guys, a five inch white round for the eyes or any other color you want to use. Um, but since I'm making a brown and white hamster, we'll keep his eyes white. So. Get started here. I'm going to start with the white first, and this is going to be for his mouth and cheeks and all that. So, I'm going to blow it up about six pumps, let a little air out. I've got that much of a tail. And I'm going to go ahead and blow both of these brown ones too. One of these is going to be about six pumps also. maybe four pumps. Okay, so I'll hold this one over here so I don't get confused. And we'll start with his face. Alright, so I'm going to start first with his little nose area. So this is just like a cat or a bunny rabbit or a ton of other animals. You're going to do three small round bubbles. One, two, and three. Okay, and we're going to twist these two together. Make his little face, and then you're going to give him two cheeks. So I squeeze them out and make little loops and twist that. Do one more loop, the same exact thing on the other side. Make sure they're the same size, about. There we go. So we've got the two loops and then the mouth area. Okay, at this point, oops, wrong balloon. At this point, I'm going to take my other brown balloon that I blew up about six pumps, the longer one, and we're going to stick it right in here. So I'm just going to use the nozzle to attach it in there. Whoop. Alright, make sure his cheeks don't come undone when you do that. And I'm going to arrange this so we've got the brown up here coming out the top. I'm going to make a loop on the top, not too big, a little bit bigger than his cheeks, but maybe like that, and twist, okay, and then you want the two balloons coming down together after that. Alright, so we're working on his face, it's kind of like a penguin rabbit mix right now. <laughs> Alright, so now we're going to do his little body, so just bring these two balloons down together, and hamsters aren't very big, so don't make them like have a really long body. We're going to keep it short. So, short little body. We're going to bring the brown one back up again into the head. Twist. 
So we've got two up and then down. No, sorry. Uh, down and then up. <laughs> and we're going to bring this one down again. Twist that all together. Okay? And then I'll fix his head here so you can kind of see what's going on. So we kind of got that now. Got it? Good. Okay. And then for his little feet, you can, I've tried different things with his feet. Um, I'm actually, I'm going to hold off on the feet for a second. So at this point, I'm just going to leave this like it is. Let's do his arms. So hamsters have really little hands too. And they're really cute when they hold stuff and eat it. But we're going to make them small little hands. So just do three little small bubbles. Like that, and twist these two together. And that'll be one little hamster hand. And squeeze your balloon out so it's nice and soft. We're actually going to take this balloon and slide it in between his body, right behind this white balloon. So, see if you can take the tail here. Get the tail through first. And just kind of pull the balloon through. And don't go too fast because you'll feel it as you're pulling it through. The friction is going to cause the balloons to heat up a little. You don't want to get too hot because they might pop. So don't go crazy fast. So we want to just give him little short skinny arms. So maybe like that long. And then do the same thing coming out the other side. We'll do a little bubble and then do his hand with three small bubbles. Big. 
so I'm a little distracted today. Okay, so I'm gonna make his eyes about this big, like the size of my palm. I'm gonna twist or tie this ball, and I'm gonna twist it right in half. You just take both hands, hold a bubble or a side in each hand, and twist in opposite directions, and try to feel and make them about the same size. So we've got our eyeballs. We're gonna put our eyeballs through this loop we made here up top. We're just gonna slip one right through that hole. So you kind of have to play with your balloon a little bit to kind of squish them through. But it's gonna be too hard. Just kind of force them in there. There you go, look at those big old eyeballs. <laughs> there we go. And now we just need to finish them off with a nose, which I happen to have right here. We're gonna just take this little pink nose and put it right on top. marker. Oh, here it is. Okay, so now we're just going to draw us little eyes on. And to do the eyes for a hamster, I'm going to do a really big circle like that. And I'm going to do two smaller circles inside. One bigger and one smaller like that. And then fill in all around there with the black. big don't eat me eyes and then you just give him little three little dots on his cheek here Ta -da! all right so I'll fix him up make sure his toes are all pointing the right direction he's got his hands on he's ready to go so that's how you make a hamster out of balloons it didn't take too many balloons and no weird shaped balloons. Um, there's a lot of cool designs you can do with geos and hearts and bear heads and duck shape, whatever. There's all different shapes of balloons that you can make really cool things with. But I don't like to carry all those different kinds of balloons in this little bag. So most of my designs are just the 260s rounds and, and some hearts maybe. So it's a pretty quick and cute hamster that you can make at your next event to wow the crowds. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to subscribe to my channel. I put out new videos every Tuesday on Tutorial Tuesday, unless I'm waiting for something in the mail. <laughs> um, also, uh, don't forget to check out our website, leave comments, suggestions, questions, um, anything you guys want to ask me about, just feel free to put in the comments because I do read those. So. Thanks again for watching this tutorial. I hope that you'll get a lot of use out of this design. And I will see you guys again next Tuesday for another balloon tutorial. Thanks for watching. Bye.